We've been hearing for months how small businesses are struggling to keep afloat during this pandemic. Well, the long-awaited commercial rent assistance program, SECRA, just launched this week. The province is kicking in $240 million, along with federal funds, brings the total to nearly $1 billion in rent subsidies. But the biggest flaw of the program, according to insiders, is that it's up to the landlord or property owner to apply. And some small businesses are saying their landlords just aren't interested, which begs the question for many many why it really boggles my mind as to why a, a landlord wouldn't want to participate in a program like this the way secro works is landlords would cover 25 percent of their tenants rent the tenant another 25 percent and the government 50 percent providing the business can demonstrate a significant loss of income due to the pandemic the federation of independent business tells me that three weeks ago about 40 percent of their members said they were unsure if their landlords would participate and advocates say there are a number of reasons why there are reasons why a landlord would just rather evict the landlord can say well look what we'll do is we'll defer your rent i still want 100 percent of it but i want it over time and for a lot of landlords that's a better deal and that's happening all over the country first they'll try to get 100 percent of rent and that will work a lot of the time if, there's, if, if, they, if they have the threat of evictions, that they can hold over the tenant. Meanwhile, the provincial government is encouraging every landlord to take advantage of what is described as a great opportunity to help their tenants and themselves, who could otherwise be looking at no rent at all. The province doesn't know how many will apply, but it's taking a wait-and-see approach. After all, it has only been up and running for two days. And that's what we really want to see as this program just opened up uh, this week. Uh, it, would, it, just, it just launched. And, and so, um, you know, every, a lot of people were operating in the unknown before this. While the Federation of Independent Business can't say how many small businesses have faced eviction since the coronavirus crisis, they tell me at least 20% are worried about it. And we have certainly heard anecdotally of people being threatened with eviction, if not fully locked out. Many advocates are calling for the government to place a moratorium on evictions for small businesses, as is the case for residential tenants. The opposition is echoing that call, and the government is not ruling it out. We need a ban on commercial evictions. Everything um, is going to be on the table from this government. Other feedback the CFIB is getting is that the application process is turning out to be quite complicated and burdensome, which is another reason why landlords might not want to go through it. The CMHC, which is administering the SECRA program, admits that it has had technical difficulties and is trying to work them out as quickly as possible. I'm Pam Seidel, City News.